Welcome to Thursday. I am meteorologist Terrell Wade, ready to give you a forecast for the next several days. There's a few things I want to talk to you about. One, we're going to be keeping the cold dry air over the state for the next few days. Two, we're going to be seeing rain over the weekend. And lastly, we're going to be seeing a trend of warmer conditions on its way. On the satellite, we have what is the remnants of a powerful nor'easter that dumped a lot of snow over the northeast. And we also have northwesterly winds over North Carolina supported by high pressure over the southeast. Now, with the pressure gradient between the high and the low, there's going to be some strong winds, including during the morning. So while it's 26 degrees outside, that 6 mile an hour wind can make it feel as cold as 19 degrees. So you're going to want to prepare for that. Throughout the day, the sun will warm the temperatures up from 28 degrees at 9 to upper 30s at noon and mid to upper 40s by 3 p.m. For Friday, the area of high pressure moves to the east and there's a storm over the plains that moves east starting to approach the state. And this will add some clouds into the sky, as well as changing the winds from northwesterly to southwesterly, which means warmer air will be on its way. So here's what we have so far. There's going to be cool conditions. There's going to be generally clear skies. Maybe a few clouds show up in the afternoon. And there's going to be northwesterly winds at 10 to 15 miles per hour with gusts maybe 20 miles an hour. So it's still going to be a cool, blustery day. At nighttime, we're going to see those clouds dissipate if there are any. The temperature drops to 27 degrees, and with that light wind, you still have to prepare for those wind chills, which may still be in the low 20s, maybe even upper teens again. For Friday, I mentioned the northwesterly winds turn southwesterly, and we get more clouds, especially during the afternoon. We can see the temperature rise as high as 59 degrees. And even by Friday night, we can be seeing rain move in from that storm over the plains. And to close out your week, we see that Saturday has an even better chance for rain and it gets milder with 66 degrees. It clears out, then Sunday ends up being cooler with a high of 59. And then Monday, we see the temperatures return to average and it can continue to be so for the rest of the week. Maybe Tuesday could see 70 degrees. I am meteorologist Terrell Wade. Enjoy the rest of your week.